are over. And we're going to be recording. So please, everyone, be aware of that. And please mute yourselves now. Thank you. Okay. Wonderful. Thank you all for being here. How amazing is it today to be an O founder in on passive? Yay! Thank you for being here. Uh, we have just been having a little fun and games before we get started today here in Australia. Uh, whether it's the heat affecting us or not, um, we are here with you. And if you are a guest here today, Thank you, thank you so much for coming and listening to this amazing presentation given by Yvonne Mackett. I would like to do an acknowledgement of country first and then we'll go into the presentation, hand over to my dear friend Yvonne Mackett who is in here from Perth in Western Australia. Thank you all for all of those joining us today from overseas, Canada, America, um, and Singapore and any of those other countries that you're coming in from, Florida, Sorry, I know that's part of the US. It just seems different. Okay, so acknowledgement of country. We would like to acknowledge the land in which we are meeting on today and pay our respects to elders past, present and emerging. We would like to thank them for the knowledge that they share with us to look after the land and each other. I want to uh, again welcome our dear presenter, Yvonne Mackett. Yvonne and I met through On Passive. We would never have met otherwise. Um, it is truly... Uh, wonderful to have such great friendship with this amazing company. We're on this journey together and all of us here as founders are on this journey together. We would like you as a guest uh, to join us on this journey and please listen to the presentation today. If you have any questions, there will be a Q&A after the presentation and we will answer any questions that you have. Do not leave here today without knowing everything that you need to know about this business. Uh, and we're ready to go. So over to you, Yvonne, and thank you so much, everyone. Thank you, Narelle, and thank you, everybody. It's so lovely to have you all here today and joining us on our Aussie, Aussie Girl and a Kiwi Guy webinar. Um, so we welcome you all um, to the Lucky Founders. Um, we've got a great journey ahead. Um, and for our Leadership Council, thank you so much for all your support. And um, yeah, for the guests today here, I'd like to um, share with you, um, for, oh, if you'd like to be part of this a revolutionary company, I would love you to just get back to the person who shared this with you um, and ask for their invite link. So today you're going to hear um, a life-changing opportunity. Now this could change your future and change your life in so many ways. This is a once in a lifetime opportunity. You will not get offered anything like this again, I'm sure of it. It's not every day this comes along. Um, you probably won't get offered anything like this again. This platform is for anyone who wants to earn an extra income. But do you fit in any of these criteria? Do you need a backup plan? Do you need a retirement plan? Are you unemployed? Are you a single parent? Have you? left school, um, not sure what to do? Are you a university student and need to pay your bills? You know, um, are you on disability or do you work online? Do you have an MLM business? Do you have a re retail store? Are you struggling just paying those high rents? Or do you own a company? You know what, it doesn't matter what you are, what you do you can be part of this company. And um, so if you, you know, um, if you want to be part of this company, this company will help you and force you to be successful. You do not need to know anything about the online world because our uh, CEO of the company, Ash Mafara, the founder of the company and his amazing tech team um, have built this company with their many, many platforms um, for you. So you can sit back and let AI go to work for you. Sorry, this is a, oops, this is a global startup company and we are moving to the next stage. We are in beta testing. This global company is a multi-billion dollar company. And if you are joining us today, 
and you join us today as a founder, before we close the positions off, you'll still be in the top 1% of the company when we launch to the world. So this is an absolutely awesome place to be or an awesome opportunity to be offered. Um, so here's your chance. We are starting stronger than any other company that has started before us. So what exactly is On Passive? On Passive is a very real business and it's a global company that is valued over $5.5 billion. It, has, um, it is an information technology company with 50 portfolios of digital tools and products that are far more superior than what's out there and all easily accessible under one umbrella and all run by artificial intelligence and machine learning technology. It's an online marketing business solution. The company has brick and mortar assets. The two buildings here we have, we have an executive office in Florida where our CEO Ash Mafara works from. And our, our latest building in Bangladesh, which is not yet pictured. Um, and we also have one opening in Singapore. But here um, on the picture here on the uh, left hand side, we have a huge six story building in Hyderabad, class as high tech city in the Silicon Valley of India. This is where you'll find the top name companies um, around such as Google, Microsoft, Apple, and many of the, you know, the mainstream businesses that you hear all the time. This is where all the um, best IT experts um, are. And as many of you may know, N India is known for their IT skills. On Passive have the best of the best software engineers, programmers, media experts, marketers and IT specialists. And our staff have come from companies such as JP Morgan, Apple, Google and many of the big brand names. Now we have approximately 800 staff and we expect to reach 1000 once we launch, which is very soon. We will definitely be a household name, that's for sure. So who is the brains behind On Passive? Well, this is our, um, a photo of our CEO, Ash Mufara. He is a man with a vision for the future. He's a very selfless man. He really does care about humanity. He is also a family man with a very supportive, beautiful wife and two young boys. His hobbies are fishing, hiking, and he has a real keen interest in NASA. He attended the American Intercontinental University for a master's degree in information technology and, uh, and e-commerce at MIT. He also completed the Harvard Online Business Creation Systems. And while Ash did his studies, he researched models like Walmart, Google, Twitter, Microsoft, Amazon, and many more. Ash also, by being in the industry and knowing the industry very well with his 20 years experience and the research he had done showed that only 3% of people earned, leaving the 97% of people um, struggling. He wanted to change that around and um, to, to allow the 97% of people to earn, not just keep it for the big wigs, the people at the top, he also learned that 320 million online businesses failed in this industry, and it was very unfair. He wanted to correct the corruption. He also understood how the internet has a potential to change the poverty into prosperity. So 97% of online businesses fail because of the lack of knowledge of online business, the lack of finances, or the lack of how to market, you recruit or sell. Ash was looking to find a fair business model. Now, he couldn't find um, a business model. He, he took years of looking. Um, he decided um, the only way to create one was to build this platform himself. And he built many platforms um, with his team of the best IT professionals. He built on passive from scratch, although it didn't have the name on passive from the start. So the company was created in 2018, but it did get a lot bigger than Ash Mafara had originally anticipated it to be. And today has a solid foundation of well over um, 1 million 2000 founders that probably share uh, that proudly share the vision of what Ash Mafara is doing 
and we support him on this very exciting journey we're on. Ash has um, given every person that joins the uh, joins an opportunity to make a change in their future and the future of their family and the lives of others. That's why today OnPassive is stronger than any other IT company that has ever started before us. And this is why we're going to be a unicorn company from the start. So OnPassive is going to be bigger than anyone can imagine. So why OnPassive? Well, with OnPassive's products, you don't need to do any recruiting. You don't need to convert leads. You don't, uh, they will guarantee the traffic, which is quality targeted traffic to your website. It's self-funding, so that's where you will only have to pay out of your pocket one time for your subscription, and then it is self-funding from there on. So this means it is all done for you, 100% hands-free. You do not need to lift a finger. It will work 24 hours, seven days a week, 365 days a year. It will never take a day off. It will never get sick. It's all done for you. It has every imaginable tool that you need for your success, for your business, and it's all, it's all easily accessible in one place on one interface. It has a plug and play system, so just anybody can use it, even if you're not computer literate at all. There is no copycat or recycled tech and you won't find a better price anywhere on the globe. So we are now in beta testing stage and the platforms uh, with the platforms and it is very exciting. Here we have 20 of the 50 digital online products. Now I'll only go through three of them as you can check them all out on onpassive.com and you'll find a short video on each of them and I recommend you take a look over there. See where this will fit into your business or your life. Now the platforms are all stand standalone companies under their own right, under one umbrella, all owned by OnPassive and all embedded with AI technology throughout. We have Oshop. This is where you can get all customized products so you can leave a mark on the minds of all your users every time they view your brand. This will help small to medium businesses. OShop also has very affordable pricing. We also have Ocademy. Um, Ocademy is, so, um, is a online e-learning um, uh, platform where you can reinvent yourself to learn and earn. Ocademy is a one-of-a-kind application for learners of any age with many more benefits such as facial distraction. Um, so when teachers are teaching, they will know when the pupil or pupils are not paying attention. You can also earn um, using this platform. If you have a class or a course that you would like to teach, you can put that on this platform as long as it, um, and it will go out to the world um, and it will be translated into 57 different languages. You can put it on this platform and you will get paid all on all the subscribers that come to your site and 100% of the fees you charge will go straight into your O wallet in your currency in real time in your back office. Now we have O Connect. O Connect is like a Zoom. This is what we're on at the moment. But we have many more benefits, and you'll be able to use this for video conferencing. So you do not need to travel. You can have unlimited people, so you can manage all your work workers across the globe. You can bring them all together on this great platform. It's also great for multi-level marketers as it doesn't limit you to the amount of people you can have or invite. And it is far cheaper than any other platform that is out there and with many more benefits. Now, Onet is our social media platform that helps you connect with friends and family and discover new friends, a bit like Facebook, but Onet will not sell your data. Now we are all looking forward to using Onet as it has a revolutionary and secure social network platform. Now we'll just go into Obless very quickly. Obless is at the forefront of OnPassive and Obless is OnPassive, OnPassive's crowdfunding platform. Now where you can raise money for any cause, charity or schools sports, fundraisers, etc. This platform will help humanity in such a big way. 
because um, we have already well over a million people. Um, so when we launch, we're already established. And um, if you put, you know, your advertised calls on there straight away, you're going to have customers and customers are able then to donate from their earnings in their own wallet in their back office. That's if they're founders. So um, you can also use the Obless platform and on Passive will give 100% to you, uh, to your cause or charity. So many other um, platforms do take between 15 and 30% for their advertising and admin. So the extra cash that Obless will allow you to keep will make a big difference in someone's life club or charity. So it is predicted by, uh, it was predicted that the market share is $114 billion for year 2021. What will it be for 2022? So it is proven scientifically in our DNA that the power of giving is 10 times more rewarding and fulfilling than receiving and taking. And that's a great quote from Ash Mafara. So on passive is the world's greatest modern technology marketing solution. It is going to be a global leader. Here we have on Passive's business model. We have 50 online tools powered by AI. We have highly targeted traffic that generates a stream of income, a stream of customers on autopilot to your website. It's a reduced cost because there's only one supplier which will save you money and has a simplified um, process with only one email and one password, which will generate a passive income every day of the year. So why do we need these platforms? Um, if you compare the list of today's current model, it's based on competition and conflict. 97% of scams turns into money pits, costing more um, each month because you want to upgrade, etc. It requires you to sell, it requires you to recruit, and the tools you need, you have to buy separately. Um, so this, you know, takes up time. You need to know where you're going. Time is money in business. So it's not very um, good. With this company, um, it's all in one place. So there's no guarantees of marketing with the old, old way, and there's no guarantees of income. The marketers are against each other and the compensation is based on your own efforts. But with today's new model that will disrupt the online world for the better is on Passive's new model and it's based on mutual benefit. It's a real business, it's real products and it is, has real people. It's self-funding so it pays you to use it. The marketer does not have to sell, the marketer does not have to recruit. Every tool you need for your success is included in one place and all the tools are included at one low price. It is 100% money back guaranteed as written in your NDA, so you cannot lose. The marketers will only compete with themselves and it has a revolutionary breakthrough compensation plan that has been patented, pat patented for OnPassive. So why OnPassive? Well, everybody will be using OnPassive in the very near future, whether they come to OnPassive for the money, the tools, or other benefits like communication and connections, they'll all have a reason to come to OnPassive. So time to completely run your whole business on autopilot. Autopilot any business opportunity whatsoever. Everything 100% done for you, your advertising, your leads, your marketing, your recruiting, and your team building all done for you by AI, artificial intelligence, all working, for, all working for you. Yes, it will automate your existing business and provide a massive income opportunity by simply using this breakthrough platform. So the benefits of being a founder, you will earn a residual income for life. You will have targeted traffic to your website given to you by the company and on passive will build your business for you and team for you automatically. You will be able to be part of the beta testing and inner circle decision making and only have to pay a one time for your subscription of the use of 50 di different digital tools and the company will go to work and market for you and then your subscription will be paid out of profits. 
you will benefit from massive marketing campaigns and you will be able to have access to every tool that you will ever need for business and it is all 100% hands-free. <clears throat> so how much will this cost you to become a founder of a multi-billion dollar company? It will only cost you to become a founder 97 US dollars. Now that is $136, that's including the bank fee. Um, and um, New Zealand, that's $138. Roughly just check on, on, on the day um, that you sign up. Now this will, um, when we launch to the world, you'll become subscribers to the online world, uh, the online business platform. And um, all the tools we have, you will only have to pay one time a 250 US dollars to have the use of um, all these tools forever. And uh, that is uh, absolutely amazing. No other company has ever done that before. Now you are welcome to have many accounts you can gift them, you can give them to your grandchildren, you can buy them for Christmas and birthdays. As long as you have a different email, you can have as many as you like, as long as you can afford the first month's subscription fee. So if someone offers you an op a great opportunity, an amazing opportunity, and you're not sure you can do it, just say yes and then learn how to do it later. Great quote from Richard Branson. So. On passive, if you become a, fo a founder of um, this business, whether you are in brick and mortar business or you have an online business, on passive will force you to be successful. You do not need to have a business to become a founder of this multi-million dollar company. All you need to do is get back to the person who invited you, who shared this with you and ask for their invite link and just get in before it's too late. Join today before we close off the founding positions and be in the top 1% of the company when we launch to the world. This will change your future and your family's future. So don't delay, join us today and enjoy this awesome journey that we're gonna have as founders. So thank you for listening. I'm Yvonne Mackett from Perth, Australia. On behalf of On Passive Aussie Girls and a Kiwi guy, Yvonne, Narelle and Kenton, we're here to help you and um, thank you for joining us today. Thank you, Narelle. I'll hand thank it back you, to Tom. you now. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Fantastic. What a great presentation. Please, yes, a round of applause applause for Yvonne's presentation. Always colourful, always informative. And we want to thank, thank you. you yet again, Yvonne, for your dedication and your time to On Passive as a founder in helping those here in Australia and New Zealand. Uh, it's hugely important right now, as you may have noticed, uh, as you may have friends that um, have thought about joining On Passive, um, this is the time. Okay, there is no time left. We just need to be sharing it out as much as possible. Uh, Yvonne and I both are volunteers. We don't get paid to do this job. We come together uh, in friendship and also have joined with our counterpart, um, <laughs> Kenton Patterson, almost forgot his name, in New Zealand, because New Zealand is a little island. As you can see, if you look at any of the pictures beside, behind myself and Yvonne, Australia is a big country. We have 25.8 million people uh, and New Zealand is about 5 million, I believe. Forgive me if I'm wrong. Uh, so I'm asking you, you know, what is it about on passive, you know, that that has us all so excited? What is the excitement about? Because there's never, ever been anything like this done before. You know, we can't compare it. You can't compare it to anything out there. Now, I'm going to see if we have any guests here. And if we don't, I'm going to call on a couple of our leadership council to have a word uh, and share their experience. Because I think it's important that you hear from each and every, not each and every one of us tonight, but from those who have been in on PASA for some time. For those who have experienced the journey for longer, uh, I myself have been in since October 2020, uh, along with Chris Johnson as well, a short time compared to some. 
but we are here loving and supporting each one. And one of the things that I think is the best thing about that is it, and how we all are brought together, how we all support and love on one another is because there's no selling and recruiting. When you have selling and recruiting that you have to do yourself in those other businesses, online, affiliate marketing, MLM, what happens? It's like a dog eat dog world out there. You want that next person. You want to sell your product because you believe it's the best. Now, even though the products might be the best or you, you believe that they've worked for you, doesn't necessarily mean that they work for somebody else exactly the same. And that's why it's hard in those businesses because I've had uh, been a part of some of those myself, some of the products I still use. But what works for me doesn't always work for someone else. You know, there might be different things in their health, you know, situations. Um, the skincare may not have you looking 20 years old. Didn't work for me, obviously. <laughs> um, and you have, you know, washing powders and things like that, which, you know, like Amway is one of those companies that have been going for like 80 years or approximately around there. You know, they have a good product. But the platform, can you imagine that they, if they were on the platform of on passive today? you know, somewhere where the work is done for you, you know, are you sick and tired of going out there or making that list and going, you know what, I've got to ring 10 people today, can't do it, can't do it, nah, nah. build yourself up, walk around the house, sit down again, pick up the phone, ring one person, they didn't answer, thank goodness they didn't answer, because I'm starting to feel all sweaty now, my heart's racing, and I didn't really want to talk to them anyway, because I didn't know what I was going to say. You know, because it might not be just your first time that you've been in those business businesses. It might be your third time. And this is the third time that you're ringing a family friend uh, or your family and saying, hey, got this best business here and I just want you to join it. And they're going, what is it this time? What is it this time? What do you want me to join? You know, and are you sick and tired of that? You're sick and tired of having to make that list? You know, it seems to get shorter every time, right? Because you're really too scared to, to ring anybody and say, hey, <laughs> got it again. I got this really great product. <laughs> um, and it does. It has you procrastinating because it does me. It does Yvonne. And it does probably 98.999% of the people on here, right? Because selling and recruiting is one of the hardest things to do. The other hardest thing is marketing. And with that, I'm going to go over to Marty DeGalmo because he is and has been uh, and still is today, you know, a great marketer who's been out there, who's shared, who knows that um, how hard it is out there online. And this is coming from a marketing guru, so to speak. I don't like the word guru, but hey, today you're it, Marty. So come, come on down and unmute and share what you have with us today. Can't believe you called me that nasty word. Um, yeah, I'm, I've been online full time for 18 years, probably 10, 12 hours a day, seven days a week. And if it wasn't from passive, I would have quit because uh, I spent many, many years, first seven or eight years, you would think I was in the contest to find out how much money I could possibly lose. And I think I have the record of that. I lost all kinds of money jumping from one thing to another to another, only to find out. You find out one thing and then you turn over a rock and there's something else you didn't know you didn't know. So I did team up with Mike Ellis and Dan Street about nine years ago, I guess now. And I did learn how to market. I marketed on Facebook. I marketed it on Twitter. Uh, I had, I had a, about 200... And, I don't know, 500,000 followers. I had 50 accounts. I tweeted all day. I tweeted like the biggest bird in the world. Glossed all my accounts because I was taking advantage of Twitter, supposedly. Uh, lost Facebook accounts. Anyway, long story short, if you cannot drive your own traffic, you will not make it in MLM or email marketing. Now, what do people tell you? Follow me, do what I tell you to do, and you'll make a lot of money. I hate to break it to you, it's a lie. And if you're lucky, 1.5% of the people make a residual income. The other 99.5 or 98.5 are not telling the truth. If a big marketer that you see or you think is a big marketer, yes, they make a lot of money. The day they stop marketing, their business slowly 
crumbles down to nothing. Why? Because they're followed by a bunch of people that don't know how to market. Then they tell you, well, you can duplicate what I'm doing. Guess what? That's not true either. If you can duplicate what all these gurus are doing, why is it it's always the same 2 or 3% that make money? Because you can't. Let's get into the facts. Just, just the facts. I would say it to any guru on the planet. There's a 1%, 1.5% that make money even if they stop working. His name is, uh, let's name some big ones. Uh, who's the big speaker? Tony, Tony Robbins. All right, he's one. Name yeah. five. You can't. You, you can't name five in the whole world. I mean, so if you think you can make it, you can't. We built teams of thousands, and I couldn't make it. Did we make money? Yeah. As soon as we stopped recruiting, it slowly died down to zero. And what happens is you, all, you try to find out how to shovel quicker than the dirt falls back in. So you try to bring in people quicker than they quit. That's what a marketing guy's doing. That's not the way business should be. And I was sick and tired of looking in people's eyes and saying, I'm going to help you when I knew I couldn't. I tried, but I couldn't do it. I would make systems for people like Ash did, except he's got a grander scale. And no matter what I did, I couldn't get people to duplicate what I was doing because they don't have 10 or 15 years to learn how to market. Then they said, well, use uh, solo ads. So you spend two or three hundred dollars a month on solo ads. Mm -hmm. One person might sign up. Guess what? He doesn't know how to market either. So in two months of paying auto ship, he says, "I can't afford to be online." He quits, and this is what goes on year after year, year after year. Three years ago, this month, I ran into Peter Rogers. I knew him. I trusted him. I said, "What are you doing?" He said, "I'm doing a company called On Passive," and I went, "Oh." I thought, well, what's the chance of finding a company that actually makes it is designed for the average person? It's slim to none. Slim to none. So I asked him, what is he doing? He told me, he said, I said, is it, uh, they have an auto ship? Nope. Now I'm thinking for all the people that I know I can bring in, I'm thinking, can they stay in? Do they need special skills? No, it's 100% automated. Okay, am I trying to sell a left handed monkey wrench in a right handed world? No. The products are in high demand and they're digital, so you don't have to pull up your closet. Okay, these checks are going off. I'm going, okay, this sounds good. Uh, but are the products, in, I mean, do people want them? Yeah, they're being sold billions of dollars a year, billions. Well, what makes this different? They're built from scratch. It's 100% automated, artificially in, induced, and blah, 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 blah. I went, okay, I'm in. And then I was waiting for the price. When he told me the price, I was shaking because I thought this is going to be five grand, 10 grand. I didn't know. And he said, $97. I said, what? $97. And I said, what? So anyway, I signed up, told Mike and Dan, we got in and built it as hard as we could. Now, what I'm telling anybody here, if they're watching this as a guest or whatever, you can jump from one shiny thing to another. But, or you could save money jumping to Unpassive. Here's why. Unpassive will build your team. We'll build, we'll get uh, customers for you. We'll, we'll take care of the customers for you. We'll support the customers for you and pay you a check every time they place somebody underneath you. And it will grow every month until the day you die. Now you weigh that against you happen to market that you don't know how to do or follow somebody that really can't help you. Now, what kind of judgment do you need there? 100% automated, guaranteed you will be successful. I never tell anybody how much they're going to make because it could be different. You could build a team and make it quicker, or you could just be passive. Get in, sit down, you know, stay, stay engaged, but don't build a team. That's okay. It might take a little longer. But in the long run, you will be successful. Yeah. It's a no-brainer. It's an absolute no-brainer. I'm sick and tired of seeing people get into businesses. There's a big one out there now, some kind of – I don't know, punk panda or whatever, and they're going to give away tokens. Listen to me. I've had millions of tokens, millions. And guess what I bought with it? Zero, because they're worth nothing. They're worth nothing until they become crypto. How do they become crypto? You, they have to be backed by something. There has to be a product. There has to be something. And yes, they'll give it away for the millions and millions and 
If you bring in 10 people, I'll give you 50 million tokens. If you bring in 200 people, I'll give you a trillion tokens. You could give me a trillion bag of leaves. All it is is leaves. And eventually they're going to charge you for these tokens because they're not making any money. You're going to pay because you figure I went this far. I might as well pay. And then what happens is now you lost $500. You got 30,000 pounds of tokens that are just absolutely worthless. Now you lost the business and on passive probably because you cross recruited like an idiot. So now you lost on passive. You lost freaking crazy panda bear or whatever it is. Now you have nothing. Be smart. Don't jump into these shiny objects. They're a lie. They're not true. I'm telling you from experience, they're not true. There is nothing on the planet like on passive. This company's going to be launched and you're going to be able to tell somebody, I knew Ash Mubara win. And I'm telling you, things will happen in this company that equals Edison, equals Ford, equals the big, big names in history. And you're going to be part of that. For 97 bucks, it's a no-brainer. And, and, and I'm telling you, the door is closing soon. If anybody's out there and wants to get in, stop being an idiot. Get in, pay the 97. What's the worst thing that happens? You get your 97 back? I mean, it doesn't make sense. So please, everybody, pay attention. At least look at what's going on. Take that big challenge, 97 freaking dollars. Get in, and you'll be, it'll be the best decision you ever make. Because everything out there is a joke. It's an yeah. absolute joke. Yeah. I'll, I'll talk to anybody. I, Set them up with me. I don't care if they're a guru or not. I've talked to billionaires, millionaires, and I talk to them just like I do you. Guy comes up to me and tells me this big fancy thing, and I tell him in a real nice way, you're full of crap. Go sell that crap to somebody that hasn't been there. I've been there. And it, what, it, really, put everything together. Don't believe me. Why is it the same 3% everywhere you go? Sometimes it's the same people. It's fact, guys. Use your head. There's nothing out there. And if we got to wait a little bit and that's our, that's our punishment, we just have to wait, how hard is that? Sit on a park bench, go fishing, go something. All you're doing is waiting. When it's done, you guys will be glad you did it. Trust me. Trust me. There was nothing like it. Nothing. And there's nobody, nobody that would do what Ask Me Far as does. He's a complete maniac. I love the guy, but nobody would do what he's doing. Nobody in their right mind. Thank God he doesn't have a right mind. But he's a genius and he really cares for people. No joke. I got stories about Ask Me Far that I will tell after the launch. I can't say it now. It will blow you away. So that's all I have to say. <laughs> Thanks, Marty. And that was amazing. Right. It truly is. Uh, when you listen to Marty, you hear him come from his heart, you know, because we had been there before, because he's been there before, you know, because he's marketed before. He knows how hard it is. And we're just everyday people, right? Nothing fancy. You all look amazing and beautiful, of course, you know, and you're kind and caring. But what you saw was that vision. That vision was from a man, our CEO, Mr. Ash Mafara, who said, hey, I want to take people along with me. I want to help those who failed in their businesses online because of the big ones out there, the big wigs, as Yvonne said, you know, the big ones out there taking and flogging your money and flogging your information or flogging your technology or, you know, flogging you the best next cream. You know, the next best washing hey, powder. One more thing, Darrell, and this is very important. All the people that you followed all your life online, the ones that did make a little money, they're coming in too. Yeah. The difference is they'll be under you instead of above you. Love Keep that. that in mind. They're coming. They're coming. They can't afford not to. I've been there. I know what it costs. I paid $800 a month just for a Weber. One thing. One thousands of dollars a month for marketing. Those people are coming. When they see what we have, you watch. And you're going to have somebody 700 people down that may bring in 2 million people. No kidding. Wait, you watch what happens. They're coming because they're struggling right now. That's exactly right. They are all struggling. Doesn't matter who you are. Like Marty said, you know, everyday people like us or those big businesses, and they pay hundreds of thousands of dollars. Some of, some of that is per month. You know, you've only got to look at the uh, platform of Zoom of what on passive pays for that, you know, eight to $10,000 a month just to house 20,000 people. 
You know, like that is incredible, ludicrous. You know, you wonder why all these big companies have for years had the monopoly, right? Because nobody else came up against them. Nobody questioned them. They just went out there and they did what they wanted to do because nobody had ever stood up and said, you know what, that's not fair. We might have thought it in our minds. We might have thought, oh, no, crap, not another one that's failed. You know, I got really upset. I had somebody, I think the last business that was put to me, man, they found out I had 4,000 Facebook friends. You know, Narelle's a lovely person. She resonates with people really lovely. You know, she's going to bring us in and, and probably make them rich. You know, but the thing is, they made me empty promises. And that hurt me. It hurt my heart because you know what? I actually believed what they were saying. We're going to be here, stand behind you, Narelle. We're going to help you. You know, we're not leaving you um, for anything, right? Well, guess what? After a month, I, I didn't hear from them. Where did they go? I know where they went. They went on to the next person that they thought that they could flog their stuff to. And it is upsetting. And I'm sure each and every one of you have been through something similar where you've been made those promises to say, hey, listen, we're going to be there. Let's do this together. What a load of crock. Here, you can see us all together. We laugh, we have fun, we share, we're all supporting one another because we care, because we actually do care. We have that heart like our CEO has, you know, that heart of gold where we want to actually help others to better their lives, to help their families, to help their relatives, you know, supporting each other, like Marty said. And if it takes a little bit of time, how long did it take for those other companies to launch one product? One product, you know, Facebook themselves. I think it took about five or six years to launch one platform. We have over 50 platforms. A lot of those are already ready, but 20 you can view over on the website at onpassive.com. All you have to do right now is reach out to the person who brought you here and say, hey, listen, I think that this is something that I really want to be in. And I don't care about what anybody else says because I see people here with heart. I hear and listen to people sharing their stories. And with that, I'm going to go over, if there's no questions yet, Yvonne, I might go over to Chris Johnson because I think that uh, Chris has a wonderful story how he's going to also help uh, those where he lives or close to where he lives. Thank you, Chris. Thank you, Narelle. Yvonne? Mwah! Perfecto, as we say. That was beautiful. Uh, very proud of you two girls. And I want to tell you a story about you two girls, and I'll talk about that in a second, Narelle. Um, you know, I'm the total opposite of Marty. And a lot of the times he says, Chris is the perfect example why anyone could do this. Yep, I worked online for 32 years, but it was an assembly line. Okay, my guru was a boss. All right. Traffic. Yep. I got stuck in it every single day, driving home and to work every single day. I didn't want to hear nothing about traffic. All right. And then I found out that, yep, I'm going to spend seven days a work, seven days a week, 12 hours a day, actually 14 and 16 hour days making that money. All right. Which at first it felt great after a few years, a few more years, I lost track of my life. I didn't know where I was. I really didn't know what time it was. All I know is when I could go to work and when I could come home from work. Uh, basically, it was extremely boring. Um, so when we say, uh, Marty says a lot of the times and everyone else does is he couldn't get people to follow him or teach them. Yep, in my job, anyone could follow me if they're willing to sacrifice pretty much 99% of their life for the sake of money. And you know what? After I retired, thank God I made it. I realized that, yeah, I made, made some pretty good money in my lifetime, but look at all the things that I sacrificed for that money. You know, birthdays, funerals, Christmases, Easter's, many things, the stuff that we take advantage of every day, you know, and that was me. I wanted to work it all. I wanted to make as much money as I can. I didn't know any better. I brainwashed myself to think I'm going to keep working, 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 and someday I'm going to stop. I stopped, all right, because I finally got some sense in my brain as, man, I can't do this forever. I just can't do it. And then some guy, some guy named Ash Mafar, I have no clue who he was, 
comes up with this idea, this vision. Hey, man, you don't got to go to work for 32 years. I'm going to do it all for you. Right now, every one of us, the problem with us as human beings, the majority of us are afraid to take a step, to take a risk, to take a chance. Why? Because we're comfortable in our little zone. Our big mistake, big mistake, because while you're being comfortable in your zone, you're missing out on things. You really, really are. And I'm so grateful that I didn't miss out on this because when I actually understood what tools were, and I'm thinking saws, screwdrivers, hammers, all right? And, I, and some of those tools I did pay $100 for. I remember I bought a real nice saw for $100. And now I'm going to get into a company for, for which is which is unheard of for 97 bucks. I used that saw one time, folks. And this $97 that I bought into a business is going to work for me the rest of my life. And it's going to do all the cutting and the screwing and the hammering for me. I thought, man, Chris, I'm not missing this one. I thought, wow. And as I understood about what traffic was because I actually hated the word traffic because I literally was stuck in it for you. It took me one hour to get from my home to my job. With traffic, it was sometimes two and a half hours. It was horrible both ways. Now, now I got this crazy guy, Ash Mafar again. He said, Chris, hey man, come here. I'm going to give you direct traffic. I'm like, you better not. He goes, no, no, man. I'm going to drive this traffic right to your laptop. Right to your website. I'm going to give you a domain name. I'm going to give you everything you need for a business, but I'm not going to give you the headache for it. I watched my parents in business for their entire lives. And boy, I tell you what, it was a 24 hour a day, seven day a week thing for them. And I'm thinking in my head, and I went to Mazda and Ford Motor Company many years ago because I'm like, Man, I don't want to live that life how my mom and dad lived all the time working, all the time worried about someone calling in sick. Now, I'm happy to say, I'm proud to say that I'm an owner of a business where I don't have to worry about payroll, recruiting. I don't even got to talk to people. Man, I love talking to people, as you can see. But this is one of those things that every one of us have been looking for our entire lives. Whether you worked on an assembly line, a factory, an office, a janitor, a, it doesn't matter, all right? Now you have something that's actually going to pay you a residual income for doing nothing, man. That's the magic words here. Now we get out and we talk about this. Why? Because we truly do care about people where we've overlooked that for years. What did we do? And don't even, don't even lie to me. Me, myself, and I is what this world has turned us into. Ash Mafara said, heck no. It's me and the world, and we're going to do something about it. I'm going to include everyone, everyone that wants to join this phenomenal company. And that's exactly what he did. And that's where I came along. That's for Narelle, Yvonne, Marty, Robert, David, Tony. Every one of us jumped into this saying, wow, I know what I did for 30 some years. I know what I don't want to do for 30 more years. Now I'm into something that's going to change my life. It's going to change my family's life. And let me tell you, I got 99% of my family in and passive because even the youngest ones, the ones that aren't even born yet. Why? I don't want them working on an assembly line for 32 years. I don't want them to even know what a 12 hour workday feels like. I want their workday to be, Hey, I'm in Hawaii right now. Hey, I went to a birthday party and we, we, we made it for three days because I didn't have to be at work. I didn't have to be responsible for anything. That's what a passive is going to give us after we launch. No, not right away. It's going to take a little time to get there. But what else do we have but time? And I'm thinking, I'm retired. Wow. And I really didn't want to. I took on a full-time, full-time opportunity to share it with everybody. And that's what I've done. And then to find out about, oh, blessing a passive. All right. But what Narelle said, a crowdfunding platform that gives 100% of the money. I've given a lot of money away in my life to help people. All right. And that, that's the only way they got 100% is when I handed it to them. Now you have the first time ever a company that's going to give 100% of that money away. Not out of your pocket. 
as a family, as a world, we're all going to come together and help these countries that just got nailed by a tsunami, twisters, tornadoes, earthquakes, no more things rotten in warehouses. We're going to get them right there. We got to find good people to do that. But when you become a founder, you're automatically an unpassive angel. All right. You're going to smell the money when you first see the information. That's the first. But then you're going to realize what you can do to help people. The guy that you just saw digging out of a garbage at a fast food restaurant because you were hungry for a burger. And there was a man digging out of the garbage looking for a, some Coke or half of a burger. That's not right. We got to stop. Just stop looking at things like that. And passive was designed by a guy named Ash Mafara, who, like Marty said, thank God he's crazy to keep this all for himself. You all know that, but I'm telling the world this. All right. There's nothing negative about him. He does not know how to say no. When he thinks of something, he puts it into action. He finds the people. He finds this, the right people to tell them, I need this done. And he gets it done. And that's exactly what a pass is all about. So be patient. All right. I waited 32 years to get a little bit of a pension. And that's what it was. It's a little bit. All right. Is it everything? No, but it's something. Yeah. But you know what? For all the hours I worked, it's really not a lot of money a month. I'm thankful for it. But what a passive is going to give you is bonuses, pay, and you don't have to do nothing, man. Most of us are going to be, as we get in that older age, you're going to get sick, backs going out, knees replaced because of work, because of what we did, whether you were sitting behind a desk driving a truck or, or, or roofing, anything, it tears your body up. And passive doesn't do any of that. It lets you sit in your own time, your own freedom, go where you want, no stress-free, perfect. And that's what it does. So I'm very proud and I'm talking way too much, but on passive is truly the last business or the first business that you're ever going to own. And you don't have the headaches to go along with it. Norell, I apologize for talking so much back to you. That's, that's uh, a -OK, okay because what you're sharing is absolutely coming from the heart. You know, what you see is a man who uh, worked hard all of his life. You know, not all of us have been in online businesses, particularly if you're getting to, say, closer to my age, 40, um, <laughs> then, you, you you know, you may not have been online for a long length of time. The young ones today don't know any different. They were born into an era of technology. They were born into computers. They were born into mobile phones. One of the things I, I wanted people to raise their hands, but... One of the things that I've been told on online business in online businesses or those that I've joined along my way is uh, fake it till you make it. Now, I don't know how that worked for you. How did you go at faking it? You know, pretending you were rich, spending the money, going to all of those yeehaw, woohoo, brighten each other up, you know, stand together watch the big people walk across the stage with their big fat checks. How did that make you feel faking it? You know, I don't know of anything in life that you can fake it. Okay. Where it actually makes you feel good. No, nah, there's nothing. I, I just sort of let the mind go there a little bit, but there is nothing out there that will allow you to do that. What you need to know firstly with yourself before on passive is to be yourself to be yourself, allow yourself to just be you. People resonate with people because they like you for the colors of your eyes, the way you smile, the way you make them laugh, you know, the way that you connect, just as Yvonne and I had, just as Chris and I have, just as Marty and we have, you know? There are people here that may not be like uh, people that you know, and we would never have met any one of you had it have not been from Passive. But thank you, Chris. That was really um, wonderful to hear. I, like I said, I think people should be sharing where they came from. What has your journey been? Because you know what? Most of the time, particularly when we're talking about business, not life, because I had a shitty life, okay? Um, but I also carried that through into business because I never, ever stood up for who I was. You know, today you see me in the real walk on. I am raw and I am real. And I will stand up and say on passive is the choice you need to make today. You can become a founder. You do not need to do anything except stay plugged in, go into your back office, have a look around, try out some of the products at the moment, beta testing, see if you can break them, you know? But I want to see that man, Ash Mafara, one day, and I want to give, shake his hand, even if not hugging. 
but shake his hand and say, thank you. Thank you for sharing your heart and saying enough, enough for those people out there who have done it for years, enough of the fake it till you make it stuff. Okay. It doesn't work. Have a look how many businesses you've been in online. Doesn't work, right? You know, if I didn't know Lids for being Lids, the beautiful person that she is, and I don't know her personally. I've never met her in person yet. Okay. Karina, you know, beautiful heart. Pat, you know, Mirthlin, all of these people that are on here. Tony, you know, uh, Sonia, Sonia, my beautiful friend in Western Australia. She saw me um, share something live on Facebook became friends because of on passive, you know? So there really truly is a deep connection here, not just a, I'm gonna make millions of dollars online and I want it tomorrow, okay? That's not why this is built. This is generational wealth. You don't, bring, uh, you don't build generational wealth by following bright, shiny objects, okay? And you all should know that. You should all know that because you will have been there and you will have been disappointed and you would have felt it all. Uh, Yvonne, if there aren't, aren't any questions, I'll go over to our next hand that's raised. Yeah. Okay, Tony, yeah. come on down, open up your mic. Thank you. Thank you, Yvonne. <laughs> Thank you, Narell. 40 years old. My God, I thought you are a lot younger than that. I thought you are about 25. Tony, anyway. she's 41 on Thursday. Oh, wow. That's great. My God. You look yeah, a lot younger than that. Anyway, she's, 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 I mean, how can you follow three tycoons like this you guys are just amazing seriously like chris seriously and i'm not lying you brought tears to my eyes just because of what you said you know about the homeless people and people that are suffering out there and and i can relate to that because i see a lot of that going on here too as well and i have for a long time and it just sickens me uh, the other night I, I i'm working the overnights now um just temporarily uh, there was this young kid, he was about 19 years old, and he was drugged out. God, I think he was on heavy drugs or whatever it was. And he was just a young guy. And I thought, my God. And he's sleeping in between like a garbage can and a building. And and it really just, it just touched me. But right. And I thought of the angels, you know, what you're putting together uh, for all of us, which is absolutely fantastic. I admire you, Chris. I really do. And I love your heart. Marty, same thing. Love you, buddy. Uh, you make me laugh with the stuff that you say. It's just amazing. And you say it just the way it is. And Narell, same thing. Like, there's just so much intelligence here. And for all you new people, seriously, you know, we're not here to sell anything. We're not here to recruit anyone. Uh, we're here to give you the, tr the true vision of what Unpassive is all about. Um, you know, Unpassive is huge. Uh, we, we, we just, it's, it's hard to, 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 um, to understand how big this company actually is. We're gonna be owning a data center pretty soon. Do you realize how big that is? When you own a data center, you pretty much own the internet. You own the world, okay? You have, you have everything in your hands right there and people come to you. Now I understand why Ash said, we're gonna be the hunted. I understand what he meant by that. And I also understand now we're gonna be the correction to the corruption. I understand all those words now. A little while back, I didn't really understand it, but now I understand it more. And the more you become involved in Unpassive as a founding member, as part of the family here, you'll start to understand exactly where we're coming from. And, and, and it's all heart. Back in the 1990s, uh, we called it the gold rush, the dot-com era. Things were pretty cool back then. You could make money back then. But now, You've heard it you know, with Marty and a lot of people that have been trying to market today. It's impossible to make that kind of money today. It really is. It's completely saturated out there. And, and, they're, selling, and they're selling people BS. And it's true, they are. This is the place to be. You know why? Because we have a team of people working together. We have a, a CEO who's completely insane for doing what he's doing for all of us, okay? And uh, because he really does care. He cares. He wants to create uh, uh, multiple Mother Teresas, okay? Because he always talks about Mother Teresa and how he admires her and her vision for the world. And that's helping poor people and helping people in general. You know, we're sick and tired of the bloody corruption. There's too much going on. So all this shiny object crap that you got out there is all just a false dream. It's not real. 
It's never going to be real unless you join on passive. On passive is the last business you need. You don't need anything like this ever again. You don't need to join anything uh, out there because nothing out there compares to what we have. And you'll never understand that unless you become a founding member and you become engaged on a consistent basis on these webinars. When you do, then you start to understand and you start to cry and have tears like I did when I was listening to Chris. You start to really understand what people are talking about. A data center, people. Do you understand what that means? That's huge, huge. Okay, when you own the world, when you have a data center, you pretty much own the world. Okay, when you own the world, now you go out there and you help as many people as possible on a large scale. Okay, the companies out there right now, the corrupt companies out there, you know what they're going to see? They're going to be, they're going to look at us and say, what the hell are they doing that's better than us? Ah, oh, that's what they're doing. They have philanthropists. Well, guess what we're going to do? We're going to try to beat them by having as many philanthropists as we can as well. Now you've got, now you've got a, a, a snowball effect. And you've got companies out there, regardless whether they do it for egotistic purposes or not, but you have them on a, on a massive scale helping people. And that's what it's all about. It's about helping people and loving each other. That's what it's about. And it really is about that. And I understand that now. I may not have been in my 30s when I was making money, and that's all I cared about. But you know what happened when I was making all that money and I lost? I lost a shitload of money. I went back to work. And I worked hard, like Chris was talking about, but I missed a lot of stuff. I had friends of mine that passed away, and I missed having parties with them and birthday parties because I was more concerned in making money, right? Now we have an opportunity to, to, to have this free time to enjoy each other's company, right? And, 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 and we can build a legacy for, for generations to come, you know, for our, our grandchildren and people that come in after us. Anyways, that's all I have to say. Thank you so much, Narelle. Appreciate it. Thank you, Tony. Thank you. Appreciate uh, everything that you share. Again, another gentleman, another founder who, who is coming from the heart, sharing with us today. One of the things that you just spoke of, before I go over to you, uh, Karina, I just want to uh, pull this out a little bit. And that was, you know, the other companies will want to, okay, well, what are they doing? You know, how come, how come they've got so many people or founders or things like that? Now, the one difference, you might find a little bit of competition out there. They will never be able to do what on passive has done right now, okay, that has built this to where it is today. And the thing is, they will never have the same passion. They will never say, have the same heart. They will never be on passive. They might throw a few discounts out there. Big deal. It's not going to affect us in on passive because they don't have over a million founders with heart. They never will because guess what? They were always just after your money. That's all they were after. Now we have a CEO who says he doesn't want to be known as the richest man, but the kindest. So what difference is that going to make in our world? And like Chris Johnson said, you know, we're going to go out there and we're, we're not just going to be one person making a little ripple because yes, that can help, but we're going to be a million plus founders out there and we're going to make a bigger ripple than anyone has ever seen okay Karina over to you sorry thank you uh unmute and please uh come on down thank you Narelle we're gonna make a big wave Yvonne great job and uh yeah I can resonate with a lot of what you guys are all saying in the heart and I mean I just I have a lot of friends now around the world and that's just really special on passive is a special place to be so I, I feel pretty blessed and honored just to be here looking forward to uh, blessing others like with Chris's book of angels. And, you know, I'm looking forward to that kind of stuff. I'm looking forward to just helping others because I believe that's what we're here for. And me, I'm, I'm huge with the ocean and, you know, I know that's going to be a chore. I probably, I don't know how I'm going to tackle to try to clean it, but I'm going to do my best because I know that's going to be ongoing uh, for a very long time. And uh, yeah, looking forward to that. And um I, I love animals. So I'm, I'm, a, I'm just, I love them very much. So I'm going to do my best on, on that as well and helping others as best I can, just buying them groceries, simple little things, you know, that you can do because we're going to be able to change a lot of lives. We're going to be able to touch a lot of people and leave a legacy um, for our family. And that is, that to me is, I don't, I, I never would have guessed, you know, that that would actually happen. So thanks to Ash and, 
and his brilliant uh, mind. <laughs> and yeah, I just love you guys so much. Thank you all for uh, letting me uh, speak and thanks so much for letting me be here as, as well, Nirel. Thank you, and Thank, Thank you. Thank you. Love and you we guys. love you right on back. Uh, absolutely, 100%. Now, Karina just touched on that what, she, what her passion is to help clean up the oceans, you know, to help the animals. Now, one of the things that overwhelmed me a little bit when I first thought about that was how am I going to help individuals or how am I going to help the homeless or how am I going to help? I don't want to just be throwing a hundred bucks here and a hundred bucks there, or a couple hundred or a thousand here at these people, right? What you do is you go out and you find the people who are already on purpose, those people who are already passionate about helping those on the streets, those people who are out there bringing fresh water to the children and putting in wells and helping them to establish their communities because each and every one of them is better off if they learn. You know, you can give a, a man a fish he'll eat for a day, teach him how to fish he'll eat for a lifetime. That's what I see it as. So find those people who want to clean up the oceans who are already doing it because they'll be out there. You know, they'll be out there sweeping the ocean of the rubbish that us as humans throw out there thinking that it's fine. When you see turtles caught in plastic rings or, or things like that around their necks, it's not good. You know, my daughter, eldest daughter is a RSPCA. Uh, she works there. She's a rescue mum. You know, so she knows she she rescued a dog with three legs. Well, it had a fourth one, but it had to be amputated. It was only a little half thingy. But there are people out there who care about animals, OK, uh, that care about the oceans, who care about our people. There's so much that we can do. A million, over a million founders strong. What sort of a ripple do you think that is going to create? OK, Robert, come on down. I'm mute and let's have a chat. I don't know how I'm going to beat all of that, and I'm not going to try. It's already been said and very well said today. Uh, I, I think Marty Dagama should get a little dull and put it beside my bed, and he can talk a bit of sleep every night. It, uh, it's really marvellous. Uh, look, I want to get back to those who want to come in, uh, and if you're here as a guest, that's fantastic. Look, I just brought a new founder in last week uh, through all the kerfuffle, uh, she finally came in. And I think really uh, what I learned out of that, it wasn't the $97 that was the issue. It was the subscription. And that, so I had to present different things for that. And although it's said on, the, on these webinars, on the presentations that you only pay once, and then after that, it's self-funding. So once we got through that, yeah, she came in and, and, I've sent her a lot of stuff, uh, uh, even with the data center now and all the other stuff that's been coming, you know, stuff. The reason why I'm just saying that, um, we all may seem like we're all broken here. We've, I've been through the same thing as uh, Marty Dagama and with Chris. I mean, I, I worked up until I was uh, 68 years old. Um, and uh, and I started five at five thirty in the morning, and I'd work up. And if the other guy didn't turn up, I'd be still working to, to do what I had to do. Um, but uh, when the boss walked up to me and said, "Listen, mate, uh, we're going to merge the company. Um, do you want to go?" I said, "Well, I was going in February anyway." He said, "You want to go now?" I thought, "Yeah, I'm going." And it was the best thing I've ever done, and that's why I'm here. The reason why I'm on these webinars, the reason why you've never seen me, even though I've been on passive for three and a half years, um, because I was working and I was tired. I, I couldn't be up at night at 12 o'clock at night. And so, but I, this has been a, an eye opener for me too, because uh, I'm enjoying on passive now more and more. That's why I never came on to webinars. I thought it didn't even have to get me mug shot up here, you know, Narelle. And uh, so for those of you who are wanting to come in, uh, a lot of us have been here for a long time. I've been in, the, uh, in here for three and a half years, and uh, I can tell you something right now. When Ash Mathara came on the, the other day and said, expand your thinking, uh, yeah, um, I'm still expanding it, and I think it's going to be a big expansion job going on. And uh, I'm just absolutely blown away with everything. And uh, for all you the, all other founders here, we've got it. Yeah, we're just talking around the, the, the soup. But for those who want to come in, get in, 
because it made me nervous even trying to get my other friend in. And uh, I'm happy about that. So hope I didn't spoil the fun here. But by the way, I've hit many kangaroos. <laughs> I've destroyed cars with kangaroos. Yeah. And that's exactly and, uh, what they do. <laughs> they do. And, and uh, anyway, thanks very much uh, for your time, Chris and uh, Marty and all those who've been on here. Appreciate your time. Thank you, Robert. And thank you for sharing that. Um, yeah, I think um, I just want to uh, expand on that just a fraction, just to make sure, because Australia and New Zealand, this is 97 US dollars. That's 136 Australian dollars, roughly, depending on how it's floating on the day. It's 143 New Zealand dollars, again, depending on how it's floating on the day. What else are you going to do with that? You want to go out for dinner or can you go out for dinner anymore? You know, like what does 136 Australian dollars buy? Very little anymore. You know, you can't even buy a, 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 your groceries and fill up the cart anymore. You know, for 136 dollars, you come out with what two bags? Um, it's terrible. The other thing is, and a lot of people don't understand, uh, Robert. You are correct. It is 97 US dollars plus a five dollar admin fee to become a founder within On Passive to become a founder and then once out of pocket to start your subscription. Yes, we are a subscription-based company. It's a platform of that. That's how this has been built. That's how those people coming in are going to be under us as founders. Marty has always said for the first time in history, you and me and everyone here, every day, wonderful, beautiful people that just want to have a go or get a break from everything else that you're doing. And all these people are going to come in under us. Companies, companies, organizations, big business, little business, small business. Where do you think they're going to go? You know, so it starts your subscription between two to three hundred US dollars. We haven't been told exactly yet, but when we do, you will know. Okay, one position is all you'll need. That, that's what Ash says. If you want to, as many of us have, or for your children, for your grandchildren, you know, for that neighbor that's been struggling all your life that you've lived next to for the last 20 or 30 years, you know, somebody just buy an extra one, you know, uh, get an extra founder position and have it there for those that you want to help that are less fortunate. You know, there's so many things that you're going to be able to do. Um, it truly is an amazing blessing to be in on passive. Uh, Lystra, please come on down. I see your hand up. Hi again, everyone. Oh, my goodness. I'm loving this. This webinar is just making me feel so alive. You know, you guys make me want to do so much more than I do already. I just want to do more. You know, I love the energy on here and I just can't understand why it's so hard for so many people to just get in just get in you know this is a business that's been handed to us on a platter for a mere pittance 97 dollars is not a lot of money I know it may be for a lot of people, but I say all the time, you go out to eat, okay? And you spend way more than that. Invest in your future, invest in your family's future. In the end, it will be worth it. It will be worth it, you know? And um, I don't know. I have this thing that I love to say. I call it my uh, mantra. I love to say, get off the fence that you're sitting on. Just get off that fence. Okay, stop looking on. Because the day will come when you're going to regret. You're going to regret that you didn't see Unpassive for what it is and what it can do for you. And oh my Gosh, I mean, I've been there too. I've been in this business and that business. I've been storing things in, in my um, basement products. And then you had to drive around to drop it off and, you know, all that. I've been there. Why? 
Would anybody want to be doing that still? And I know a lot of people do. Just get in on passive. You pay your 97 and you do what you have to do in there. If you want to share, you share. You don't want to share, you don't have to share. But if you want to do it quickly, yes, you share. So all the people here that's listening, if you're not in this, just take Lystra's advice and Chris's and Marty's and Narelle's and Yvonne and anybody else who spoke telling you what this is. Just get in. Please get in. You will not regret it. You know, it'll make your life easier, your children, your grandchildren. Their future will be set for life. That's all I have. Thank you, you know, Lisa. just do it, people. Just do it. <laughs> thank you. Okay. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Um, Niraj, uh, if you can just hold off one second, I just want to expand on what Lister said there. Okay, and one of the things I want to touch on is Australia and New Zealand. I'm calling out to you. If we have guests here from Australia and New Zealand, do not think that the government is going to prop you up for the rest of your life. Do not think that you know, that you can just get by on what you're getting by on. You know, do you want to live at home forever? Do you want to, have you got rid of that thought in your head that you want to have the Australian dream of owning your own home? You know, how far do you want to go in life? Do you want to go to uni? Um, but you think, oh, well, whatever the fees are, how, how am I going to pay for that? Or is it stopping you from doing that? You know, are you nearing retirement and think, you know what? I've had enough. I've worked all my life. I've worked my guts out. Heck, when I, from the time I was 10 years old, I was working on a dairy farm, shoveling cow poop, you know? Oh, yay. But I didn't get paid for it, you know? And then mum said, you've got to go out and pick beans on the side of a hill that even a uh, mountain goat would find uh, hard to handle. You know, we've all been out there and we've worked our guts out. And particularly when you get to a certain age in life, 40 plus, um, you know, it. you really have to think, what have I got? What have I worked for? Now, I've had money and I've not had money and I've had money and I've not had money and I've had, you know, relationship breakdowns and I've had to raise my children by myself. You know, if you're a single mum, a single dad, if you're struggling out there, anyone in Australia and New Zealand, you need to start listening to this. Things are happening here in Australia in particular we need you to start opening your ears and listening to what on passive is going to do for you and for our country. This isn't just about America. This isn't just about, you know, uh, Canada or it's not about the UK or Ireland or New Zealand is our mate. You know, we have so many New Zealanders living in Australia that it's their second home, you know, and people just fly across a couple of hours and they're in New Zealand beautiful place. We have amazing people here and our, um, our wordings from Australia, from those Aussies, true bred Aussies, you know, come on, mate, you need to get off your backside and do something here. Don't put your head in the sand and think that the government's going to prop you up for the rest of your life. It ain't going to happen. And if you're in your 20 and 30s, even in your 40s, there's a cutoff time for pensions. So how do you think you're going to survive? Do you want to be one of those people on the streets picking in the bins? You know, it happens here too. Yes. And there's more and more going to happen because you're not going to do anything. You're going to sit there and go, she'll be right, mate. I'll just let somebody else do it for me. And then expect somebody else to pick up the pieces when your life falls apart. And yes, I'm being very straightforward there. But it is time for Australia and New Zealand to say, get off your backsides. This is enough. It's time to... Time to have a look at something that will set you free, okay? It is time. And guess what? You don't even have to do anything or you don't have to do a lot, okay? Just stay plugged into your back office. All for 136 Australian dollars and then two to 300 US dollars, whatever that equates to in Australian dollars, maybe about 400 US uh, Australian dollars. So for under $500 or around $500, you're going to be a founder in a multi-billion dollar business that is going to change your world. And look at the amazing people you're going to meet. 
honestly, um, you, you, you would spend more on a Saturday afternoon at the pub or if you're going out to uh, bet on the horses or things like that, all you have to do is pay this once and you're going to be set up for the rest of your life. Niraj, I am absolutely honoured to have you with us today. I truly feel very blessed that you have um, come on to our webinar today. So please open up your mic and share with us today. Thank you, Nirel. Uh, this is the first time I'm coming on the Australian webinar, so really proud of it. And uh, uh, sorry, um, uh, uh, you're not able to see my camera in a, a right way, so sorry about that. Uh, but I'm very excited. Uh, I joined in 2018 when there were only two videos, and I'm sure a lot of people uh, in here, I uh, listened to them and they joined in 2018. And what 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 I really understand from that, like, uh, and I do a, a lot of searching on Google. So based on that, I'm just letting you know that have a look at the unicorn companies of the world. The number one company is called ByteDance, and it is into artificial intelligence. And what are we into? Uh, Sorry, no, are, you're right. Go ahead. Yeah, we are into artificial intelligence. We are uh, like we are uh, going to be a super unicorn. Just have a look at uh, like the communication software that uh, uh, we are going to uh, communication or the uh, uh, teaching uh, education. The uh, product that we have in education. Uh, it is like right now, it is already running in billions and it is supposed to reach 1 trillion by 2026. And that is just one product of ours. So have a look at collective or have a look at the collection of all the products that we have and understand the value of the uh, our company. And that's, um, and, uh, there is still a chance to become a founder and don't miss this opportunity because you are going to be hunted. Uh, and that's what I can say. Thank you very much. Beautiful, Naraj. Thank you, thank you. And again, thank you for um, blessing us with your presence. Um, it's always lovely. As you can see, Australia and New Zealand, all over the world, 212 countries were coming in from India, the US, Singapore, um, all over the world, UK, Ireland, um, and here in Australia, we always have been, yeah, Canada, sorry. <laughs> um, we have always been, or we've always felt like we're right away from everybody else. And you know what? Australia is such a beautiful, rich country that I was listening to something just recently to say that we don't even have to import. That's how much stuff we have in Australia, whether it be food or mining, you know, the coal and things like that. We are self-dependent on ourselves and yet we're part of the world, you know. So what part of the world are we? You know, have you asked yourself that? Where do I fit in? You know, because this is an amazing company built on heart, built on passion, and you will fit right on in if you come with that attitude. You know, if you come with an attitude of thinking that you know everything or you know everything better, or you've got this product and that product and rah, 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 because I've heard it all before and I still get it today. Stop trying to sell me into something which has we we're already explained about. It's falling by the wayside. Yes, those products can be amazing. We use them. Some of those products we use. But do you imagine if those products go onto the platform of OnPassive, those good quality where they never could before? You know, they sell them on an MLM uh, marketing platform. Why? Multi-level marketing. Why do they sell those products there? Why don't they put them into shops? right? Because the expense is so much and it's easier to be able to bring people on to say, hey, I'm going to, they, they get you to do the work, right? Companies get you to do the work by building teams, by building and selling their products, you know? It doesn't work. It does not work. Let's help those companies too to get those great products out there, you know, by bringing them into on passive and onto the on passive platform. You know, if you're a guru out there, which I don't like using that name, but again, 
you know, as Marty mentioned himself, you know, you've got Tony Robbins. How much do you think he spends on marketing? People know him, yeah, he built a name, right? But how much do you still think today that he spends on marketing? He gets people in, could be a free ticket, could be a $100 ticket, could be a $100,000 ticket for all I know, because I've never been to him. And I've never had to walk on fire because I am on fire. <laughs> no, I'm just saying, <laughs> sorry, I was just liven you all up. I saw you falling asleep there. But anyway, look, our time is up and we have had an amazing morning. If there is anyone, Australia, New Zealand, I'm calling out to you guys now, please raise your hand and we will bring you forward uh, to have a little couple of minutes before we finish off. Oh, I, I don't know, but uh, last time I looked at Chris, he was in Australia, nor... New Zealand. Um, he, wear, he wears that hat, hat like a true Aussie bloke. Master slaps like a plum. This is what you look like when you, when you eat kangaroo. <laughs> <laughs> Chris, oh, Chris, no. I like your new name. Oh, no, did it again. Master. Oh, oh, the great. thing is, with, uh, we kangaroo have fun. It's supposed to be really good for uh, slimming down. So perhaps, Chris. Uh, and Marty, it might be a good meet for you to look into when you're coming over. <laughs> <laughs> no, wow. Well. You just got to have fun. Come on, you guys. You know I'm not claiming serious, for goodness sake. Uh, if you don't know me well enough by now, then you don't know me well enough <laughs> by now. Um, that's okay. okay. Now, if there is anyone else who would like to say anything, Yvonne, would you like to uh, come forward and say anything at all? Yes, I would like to say thank you very much, Narelle, for being an amazing host. And I'm going to say it on here because it's out to the world, but happy birthday for Thursday. You can have a birthday week. So I know people aren't going to get on on Thursday because it's early hours of the US, but happy birthday for Thursday. You've been an amazing friend and an amazing business um, partner in On Passive. So it's been a great journey with you. So thank you. Thank you. Happy and, birthday. Um, Happy birthday. You. It is um, a true blessing. You know, birthdays to me have always been special because um, it's that one time of the year where it becomes just about you. Because as a mum, you know, as a parent, as a sister, as an aunt, you know, your life is spread all around sharing and giving when you have a giving heart. So one day of the year, you get to celebrate you. And I've always said that to people, my children, whatever. One day, this is your day. What do you want me to cook for dinner? <laughs> you know, um, what is it that really sort of makes you feel happy? But it is a blessing. Every day is a blessing, you know, because I had open heart surgery and I survived. But I still uh, go through times with that. But we all do. So reach out to one another. You know, if you're suffering, if you're lonely, if you just feel like life is crappy, you know, because it sometimes can be crappy and we have those days where we should just roll out of bed and then roll back in the other side. We all have days like that, right, where we don't want to deal with people or talk to people or say anything, really, you know. Uh, I'm not a coffee type of person and I'm usually pretty happy, um, but that we all have days. And all I'm saying is reach out. Each and every one of us here, the million founders that are all over the world, if there's somebody in your area, reach out to them. Don't ever think that you're alone. And in on passive, we are in this together. You know, I don't like that saying in the whole world thing because we're not in that together. We're all in different boats, all right? And we're all paddling, some paddling backwards, upwards, downwards, in the rapids, whatever. But in on passive, it is stability. It is security that you're going to get here. And not for just your life, but for your children's and your grandchildren. Generational wealth built with a platform of IT products, you know, built with a product that's going to send out that ripple by using Obless, by sharing Obless, and 100% of the money goes to those people in need. So thank you, thank you, everyone, for being here today. We appreciate your love and support. For those who've joined us on the live, thank you ever so much. Uh, if you have been brought here by somebody, please reach out to them, you know, reach back to them and say, hey, listen, just get me in. Uh, for any of those who need help with anything else, please reach out to Yvonne and myself. 
If you have any questions or you'd like to know anything about our On Passive Aussie Girls, we have a Facebook like page where we keep you updated on the uh, webinars as they are coming forward. We do two a week, one on Monday for our guests and one on Thursday night for our uh, founders. Uh, we also attend many others uh, throughout the whole week uh, from the Caribbean to Botswana and Norway. <laughs> uh, you can see us just about everywhere and in the US as well. Um, let's hope that this week and pray this week has more and more um, abundance coming to each and every one of us, more and more blessings, blessings upon blessings, um, because that's what we're all here for, is to bless each other. So thank you once again. Uh, if, you, if there isn't anything else, I'll, Tony, I'll give you one minute, <laughs> starting now. <laughs> yeah, I do, I'll, I'll make it very quick, Narelle. Thank you. There are a lot of <laughs> there are a lot of uh, sick people in the company, as we know. Uh, so let's uh, let's pray for them. I, I really do believe in the power of prayer. So, and uh, we'll bring them right back to the healing process. Thank you, Narelle. Thank you, Tony. And yes, you are right. There are a lot of people suffering in our world. You know, so um, uh, on uh, in our founders in on passive and all over the world. And it doesn't matter where you are or what you believe in or what you think, the biggest part that you can do and it is written is love. Love is the answer because love, how can you be against love? There is nothing that can go against love. So reach out, reach out to those people, pray if you pray, keep them in your thoughts, whatever you want to do, there are many. So thank you, Tony, for that reminder. I do appreciate that. Um, I will just finish off here. And what I might do is, uh, Marty, if you would like to finish the live streaming, that would be great. And the recording.